Give me about 10 minutes to show you an amazing multi-generational house. So many buttons. First of all, right next to you, you've got this common open space. Enjoy it. You said you wanted a three-car garage. There it is. And you're on a cul-de-sac. I'm in Bent Creek, one of our favorite, favorite neighborhoods. And uh, I'm just closing on the house right next door. Some people moving up from the Midwest. And I told them I'm going to try to find them a good neighbor. Now, when I say multi-generational, don't just think a mother-in-law suite. This thing is completely multi-generational. I'm going to paint you that picture and tell you that story. Got laminate floors, real pretty brown, and uh, you know, really running all the way through this main level. So you've got that formal. What is that? A living room? Maybe that's mom and dad's living room if mom and dad are living here in this front bedroom. But hey, I've got some other ideas for mom and dad. So let me get this right. You're in your 50s, you got a job promotion transfer in Charlotte, but you don't want to leave your parents in their 70s or 80s. They don't want to leave uh, Scottsdale or wherever. But uh, one fall, one health issue can change everybody's mind. This one has a beautiful ensuite. Now, if they're not interested in that one because it's got a tub instead of a shower, certainly that can be changed out, but I'm going to show you another option. Eight foot doors, guys. Man, I love Taylor Morrison. And this Pikewood plan is amazing. So there, right there, was one ensuite. We're going to go upstairs and we're going to go downstairs. Beautiful white cabinets, white kitchen, light quartz. But uh, I showed you the three car garage from the outside. Let's actually go in because you may be a woodworker. You may want to have a place to work on your cars. Now, first of all, what do you notice? What's the first thing? That that two car garage door bumps out further from the one car. So in other words, that's plenty of room. And isn't that like a standard space? for a garage, but here you've got that extra, it looks like four feet of a bump out, Renai tankless. So in other words, for those of you that have those big pickup trucks and you have trouble squeezing them into a 20 by 20 garage, take note of that. I want you to really take note of that. Love to help you buy this house, guys. This one's priced in the 550 to 575 uh, realm really great price so if you saw my blog article about how to combine households and really I think the article was called why not combining your households is costing you money man look at see this pike woods that that island has always been the stunner so you've got a gourmet kitchen 42 inch cabinets big 36 inch cooktop really nice this is when I when I say multi-generational what I'm really saying is you've got a number of distinct bedroom and living spaces plus this deck is your deck and you're private because you're on either side you've got your you know you're enclosed but you're looking outside to that beautiful uh, yeah that's where Jack the real estate dog would be running so you've got that but right below it guess what coming off of the basement you've got a similar space Plenty of room for built-ins right there. That have got blinds on the windows. I'm sure Taylor Morrison wants to sell this house. And I told my people next door I'm going to find him a good neighbor. So give me a call at 704-345-3400. So we saw that front bedroom, correct? Track with me, count. Now notice this is an ensuite. That door goes right in. And maybe mom or dad would prefer this one because it's got a shower. I don't know. And uh, wouldn't you like to have your, your, your mom right off of the kitchen? I know, right? You miss her recipes. And so this is a way to invite your mom and or dad to move with you to the greater Charlotte area. Give them their choice of bedrooms. But there's our second distinct bedroom and living area. Are you tracking with me? And notice that these floors run all the way through like that. Isn't that what you want? You like that, don't you? Most people want it that way. And then you can certainly use uh, area rugs to soften it and, and so on. Man, we got a nice bright sunny day today. So here's your master bedroom. Nice size, plenty of room, got a little bit of a tray to it. Now, I hope you're sitting down. And if you're driving, you probably should pull over because I'm going to show you a shower to uh, beat all showers. Man, that is good looking. Rectangular undermount sinks. Look at this shower, y'all. This thing is like a car wash. Man, look at that. It's got tile all the way up. Look how beautiful that is. Nice, huh? And of course, you've got the transom windows up, three of them. Wow. So make you dizzy. Whew. So 
plenty of room for makeup and so on. Got a little bit of a, of, of a linen closet there and a commode room off to the right. And then plenty of room in the closet as well. So this is our third distinctive. So when I say multi-generational, we got you, we got your mom and or dad and whichever bedroom they don't want, you could give the second one to maybe one of your middle school kids. I don't know. Or have it as just as a spare bedroom. But that's three, right? Well, let's just go on downstairs and we'll end upstairs. Watch this. Oh, this is beautiful, guys. Now, a finished basement. And I know a lot of you up north, uh, you're used to, you know, dugout basements. But here, we fancy walkout basements, not dugout. This is finished. And what you've got here is several rooms, several spaces. So, I mean, you could run a small country out of this place. And look how beautiful that backyard is. Where's Jack when you need him? Got some woods back there to enjoy our deciduous trees and the four seasons. So let's just start. We've got a bedroom right here. So who gets this bedroom? Maybe mom and dad want this one if they're still good with stairs. And uh, they're happy to go up and down the stairs. And the cool thing about that is, if that ever changes, then you can move them, let them have their bedroom of choice on the main level. But maybe, maybe this is the ticket to, give, to offer them this and let them have all this living space to kind of replace the house that you're asking them to move from. So look at this. This is just expansive, guys. Cool thing about a house with a basement, just think about the square footage on the main level. You are basically duplicating that. That's a whole nother rec room, bonus room. Because that basement foundation goes all the way around the perimeter of the first floor. And so you've got all that space. So is this huge? Bedroom, one, two, three, really four other rooms. Magnificent. And then, okay, here it is. This, this, if this doesn't get you, got you a three-car garage, got you no house next door, some common open space. And here's a place for your workshop, your pottery barn, my YouTube studio, uh, and excellent. I mean, it's got everything Uncle John needs, I'm saying. Everything that Uncle John needs. So this is Bent Creek. And if you haven't seen my videos all about Bent Creek, then I encourage you just to type Bent Creek into my YouTube search bar. Go to my channel, make sure you subscribe, and just type in Bent Creek. I've got all kinds. We're in Indian land just south of Ballantyne in South Charlotte. And as we often say, almost everything is cheaper in South Carolina. Start with your gas. You know, when we cross the state line, I live in South Charlotte. When you cross the state line, you look at your gas gauge. Do I need gas? I'm in South Carolina, right? Well, this Pikewood plant has been a winner for Taylor Morrison. And a lot of the models, they build it out with a back porch. So you can have a upstairs back porch there. But here's a whole nother generation. So you, now you've got returning college grads. So maybe they like to pay rent up here. Charge them rent, please. Put it up, you know, room and board. And uh, if you want to just put that money in an account, give it to them for a down payment when they call me. Man, what a beautiful day. So guys, give me a call at 704-345-3400. Love to be your buyer's agent, especially if you're relocating to Charlotte. I make that easy for you. And between me and one of my broker partners, we're going to tighten you up and take really good care of you. And when I say tighten up, I remember what Archie Bell saying. We can uh, dance just as good as we walk. Love to help you. 704-345-3400 reference Bent Creek.